right? Week four, Spanish eight. Here's what you got to do. All right. You got two assignments here. Uh, start with education day three. Last week you did education day one and education day two. So this is the third one. Click on view assignment. Super easy. It's a Word document. You just click on it. It opens up right here. Anytime we get a Word document, we have to click edit document, edit in browser. This will allow us to type onto the document. Okay. Um, and at, actually, at first, we don't even need to type. We're just highlighting the correct answer. So we got multiple choice here. And when you have your answer, now I have no idea if this is really the answer, but you just highlight and then you grab the highlighter here and just go pop and it highlights. All right. I'm going to undo it because I don't know if that's right or not. You're going to have to look, figure out if that's right or not. But for the multiple choice, you just highlight your correct answer, highlight your correct answer. Okay. Then down here, you're listing six positive adjectives that describe you in Spanish, one per box, and you type it right in those boxes. And then down here, you're fish off with a little matching. Here's the uh, words in Spanish, and these are um, the, wait, type the letter of the skill next to the appropriate job. So these are jobs, and these are skills. You match the skill to the job and type in those boxes right there. Once you have everything filled in and highlighted, click close, click that purple turn in button. All right, go back here uh, to earning a living day one. This is the new one. It's the other one you need to do. It is a Word document. Anytime we get a Word document, edit document, edit in browser, allows us to type into it. Uh, we got some matching right up here at the top. Um, so you just type your matching answer over here, the letter over here in the yellow box. Uh, then down here, uh, using the reading above, type the letter of the correct answer to each question. So we got four different job descriptions here, A, B, C, and D. And you answer which job is part-time. So you figure out which A, B, C, or D is part-time. Type the letter here. Obviously, there's seven questions and there's only four different jobs. So you will use them more than once. And that's it. That's all you got to do for that second one. So nice. Once you have all of that filled in, click close. Click that purple turn in button. That's all you got to do for Spanish this week.